Hello and welcome to The Power Play on Around the Wicket. I'm Nerily Meadows. I've got Callum Ferguson alongside me and Pakistan legend Waka Yunus as well. And Waka, we're going to start with you because we've had a question in on social media. What does Shaheen Shah Afridi need to do to get back to his usual fiery pace? Well, if he's not fit, he needs to get fit because what I see is the pace is down and, and he was lethal or, or more effective when, when he was, you know, bowling at 145. He's not going to get much uh, out of, uh, you know, Australian pitches if you're going to bowl 130 or, or even less at times. So I think he needs to fix his issues and he needs to run in hard. A bowl may be less overs, but bowl quality overs. I think that is what, what, what key, uh, which I feel. Because last time around when he came and he bowled, he was bowling 150. And suddenly, you know, drop of pace and, and suddenly, you know, there's no real manum. I think there are big issues, big issues. So he needs to really fix those issues and start playing good cricket. Gosh, it's a tough one though, isn't it? Because the mm. position that Pakistan cricket is in at the moment and the lack of genuine pace and genuine quicks, if he then took some time away to get his body right, where, did, where would it leave Pakistan cricket? Well, you know, sometimes it happens. You know, you know, you have injuries and, and, and sometimes you get injuries in clusters, you know, you get, you know, more players injured than, than fit players. So, you know, you got to, you know, uh, take that pill and, uh, and, and try to fix things rather than just keep playing injured or keep, uh, if you have issues, then if you keep going with that, you're going to damage yourself, you're going to damage team more than anything else. So, I, I feel that, you know, uh, he looked better, to be very honest. He looked a little bit better in the second inning. Uh, he started running in better. He was hitting the, 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 the length properly. So I think he will be much better in the in the boxing day, Tasman. I think if you've got the opportunity to get him fit, you mm. take it because really it comes down to whether you want to be good yeah. or you want to be great. Mm. And if just being good for the next two or three years while he's in his prime, he's not getting the best out of himself. Mm. That's not helping them. If they want to be great, get him fit. Give yeah. give the guy who's a chance to be a world beater for your team every opportunity to be great. And Ferg, I can't speak to facing it. You can. Mm. Um, yes, we love to watch blokes like this oh, yeah. absolutely steaming in. I mean, yeah. it's, that's worth the price of admission in itself, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. And they, it, you play in winning teams when you've got stars like Wakar or Wazim and, and Shaheen are at their best. And they've got to get back to that. And the best way to do that is if they've got him at his absolute best. And, and I know how horrible it is facing... Shaheen, he swings it late, bowls 150 mm. when he's at his best. You think you've got it covered and your leg stumps lying on the ground. It is just a horrible feeling facing guys like that, but it's just such a thrill to watch. Yeah. I like my seat right here in the safety oh, of the studio. Me Thank too now. <laughs> and a little bit of a sticky one coming in from social media. Do either of you two have any regrets from your playing days? And like I'll say, this is either on or off the field if you had too much fun at any <laughs> <laughs> I think we both probably had that at different stages. Yeah, yes, yes. But we're not going to talk about that. No. But, uh, <laughs> Tell that. But... Uh, yeah, I mean, we all have, you know, had great moments in, in life and, and, and a little bit of regrets. I, I'm not saying that it's a massive regret, but I do uh, regret that I didn't play the World Cup here in 1992. I was, I was on, my, on my peak. I was probably bowling the best mm. in the tournament at the time, but uh, I hate Bendigo. That, that, <laughs> was, that, that is all happened in Bendigo. I just, you know, in the field. You from Bendigo. How do you no, no, feel? No, no. no please, please don't feel bad. I didn't mean that, <laughs> but I just... Uh, Think of becoming the new, I know, like, Brisbane no, comes at Kevin good. Peterson. Oh, yeah. I, I have to shut up. Isn't <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I got injured there and um, and to had to just sort of go back. Uh, and, and on top of that, Pakistan winning the World Cup and then, you know, mm. receiving mm. them back there, it was heartbreaking. So maybe a little bit of regret. I, I won't regret it at all because I, I had a great career and uh, I really enjoyed every bit of it. As long as you don't regret coming in this studio. No, I love it. We love it. Oh, keep, keep bringing me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ferg, what about you? Any regrets? Oh, look, I, I had a few injuries as well, which were tough. Run outs uh, in my first test match, <laughs> in my first Sorry. innings run out. Um, I look back in, over the years at the IPL auctions and just think, I wish I'd got the, le the ball in my left arm, bowled left arm orthodox and practised my slogging a bit <laughs> earlier in my career, I reckon. That would have helped. <laughs> the IPL, a little bit of a $4.4 million pay. By the way, on that, did you ever bowl a delivery across your career that you thought that was worth 13 k that one delivery alone? <laughs> uh, well, 
and in my heydays when I played for for county county cricket at Surrey, I was one of the highest paid at the time. But it, my entire you know, seasons, you know, salary was probably you know the guys playing cricket now it was a week salary. <laughs> so I mean, I'm all good. For, I'm go, I'm all good and happy for them. But yeah, there's a lot of money. That's if it makes it. you feel any better, Mitchell Stark's over is more than my salary. Oh. <laughs> so thank you, Walker. <laughs> $4.4 million, Mitchell That's outrageous. Stark. Congratulations. Ferg, Waka, thank you so much thank for joining you. us thank on you. the Power Play. Make sure you get your questions in for a bit of fun. This is Around the Wicket.